Uh, greetings, Facebook. Uh, I have promised to make a video of the resurrection of the mental dead. And this is that video, and this is why it's coming to you in a way that it is. First place for openers, there is no people in America that is more brain dead than the American Negro. And I'm talking about these wannabes, individuals who will sit there and denounce their African heritage to be accepted by European culture. This is a classic symbol of the Ma'afa. The Ma'afa is what is the major cause of our problems here in the Americas being of African peoples. We are hated for who we are and we are despised if we stand up and defend ourselves and try to protect ourselves and try to protect our culture, what's left of it, and our way of life. My Alpha is a disaster so bad that it is beyond description. Dr. Marimba Ani had did very, very excellent work on this, and I believe she wrote a book called, or a writing called the Urugu, as well she goes into great details about the Ma'afa. And it's a disaster beyond description. The brutalization, the violation of our women on this plantation system, uh, ever since that we were brought here to the Americas, and what's been happening in the last year, of all these questionable police killings where the value of black life has been devalued. We currently have intellectual de-evolution. Shit like Empire on TV and in Hollywood and motherfuckers are sitting up there eating that shit and does nothing to, except that does nothing but to degrade us. And the reason being why this shit goes on is because Hollywood does not give a fuck about us. They never have. Only those damn Jigaboo movies, that Amos and Andy, Rochester, Yasser, Boston bullshit. And then they get these stupid, ignorant ass motherfuckers who run out there to Los Angeles thinking they gonna be the next big star and what have you, which is a bunch of shit. I grew up in Los Angeles. I could tell you all the goddamn lies and bullshit that they're gonna come to you with. And then last but not least, what we're gonna talk about is these pulpit pimps who take our money, out of the community, through the collection plate every Sunday, poor people putting all their hard-earned money of what they got in there into these jack legs ass pockets. They in turn take that same damn money, which has been calculated to be in about the last two years, about $24 billion that these no-good bastards make, lying to us in the name of religion. They in take it to white banks who in turn loan the money out to people who cannot pay it back. They thus in turn lose their property. I've seen a lot of this here happen in Oakland, California and particularly with our people. So let's get back on with it with the resurrection of the mental dead. There is no people more dead in the head than black people here in the United States of America. They sit there, they spit on their heritage, they sit up there try to assimilate into other cultures that hate them and that despise them for simply of who and what they are. And then I also got the crumb bum on his ass scratching Yasa boss, no good ass motherfuckers. And here's my list. Charles Barkley, fuck you. You don't know shit. You talking about slavery wasn't that bad, you ignorant. Bastard, you should have learned something when your punk ass went there and got that scholarship, you stupid motherfucker. Another uh, no good sack of shit is a bastard by the name of Jonathan Gentry. I'm not related to that son of a bitch. He espouses ignorance and complacency and subservience as well in his lectures. Fuck him also. Also too, Raven Simone. That woman is so fucking ignorant. Later for her with her bird brain ass talking about she's from every continent in Africa. Don't you know, dumbass, that Africa itself is a continent full of countries with over 800 cultures that we come from and languages. My coon list. Raven Simone, Steve Harvey, Michael Jordan, Charles Barkley. Steve Harvey, you don't give a damn about slavery, you ass scratching, skinning and grinning house nigga. How dare you sit up there and say some shit like that? And for all you stupid ass ignorant motherfuckers out there that loves them and that go up there and give Michael Jordan your hard earned money and this son of a bitch owns money in private prisons incarcerating his own people. The stupid motherfucker. No, he's not stupid. We're stupid to go buy his shit. 
fuck him. Boycott Hollywood. We have the resources, people, where we can flex our economical muscle. Also, to get back to our mineral resources on our continent is because every other group of people is getting rich off of our resources except us. Something is very, very wrong right here. This goes against the laws of mathematics. It also goes against the laws of logic. It also goes against the laws of intellectual evolution. What you have here currently is intellectual de-evolution. I see a damn video where some little baby two years old is up here covered with all these gang banging tattoos talking about motherfuck this, motherfuck that, bitch I'll kick your ass and all that old kind of shit. So that little baby's already fucked up and not even five years old yet. It's up to us people to take care of us. Once again, we need a, a resurrection of the mental dead. So when you go up there to church tomorrow, think about that. Hallelujah, talking about a resurrection and we need a resurrection of the fucking mental dead. Thank you so very much for tuning in.